Today, I'm going to show you how to start this 7500 watt generator. Now, you can see what I did is I pulled that out straight from the garage with the handle facing the house. And we're looking at the muffler side. Now, before we do anything, we're going to want to find the big cord. And we're going to want to plug this in. Now, you can see one side is plugged into this box. We're going to find the other side. Looks just the same. We're going to bring it around front and uh, plug it in the only spot it can, which is all the way to the side. Make sure that's plugged all the way in like that. Now, since we're over here, you're going to go ahead and make sure that the idle control is off since we're starting it up. Now, the next step is we're going to want to make sure the fuel is on. So I'm going to just come right over here to the right. And if you get down here, you'll see from the gas tank, there is a red switch. You're going to want to make sure that's up and down. Up and down is on. So next thing, you're going to want to go and look right here. Make sure the switch is on run and it's not on stop. So make sure that's on run. If you're going to look at the choke, turn the choke all the way over. Now the choke's on, we should be good to go. Gas is on, switch is on, choke's on. Let's give it a start. When I start it, I'm gonna wanna go ahead and turn the choke back off. Now, what you're gonna wanna do is go to the house Go to the middle panel and you're going to take this and you're going to switch this all the way down to the other on position. I'm going to leave it on this one. This is the house. This is the generator. You're going to switch that over and you're going to be running on generic power. <laughs>